Diabolis Sakuni Bamel Nana Bukele Makaya. Welcome to Unmasking African Truths and Insight by African Hidden Voices. The African Hidden Voices is a research organization that aims to retrace the steps of African indigenous spiritual heroes and heroines. I am your host, Upalisa. Um, in, in, in topic here, mental health is often considered to be a taboo in many African societies, and it is often associated with uptagati and or the wrath of e, e ancestors on individuals who have defied or rather abangatatana imiyalelo ya bo ama ancestors. Um, the month of October, Ngokom Shaba, is designated as a month where uh, uh, people um, are, are made aware of e mental um illness and also a month to mobilize e efforts to support Abantu who suffer from e mental illness. Uh, today we will be discussing e the major causes of e mental health in Africa. What are the major um, um, causes of e mental health in Africa? And there's always an Aminedo Namanao Imboni, Dr. Uzilezwe Khadebe, an African indigenous uh, spiritual guider. Imboni is also the, the leader and the founder of e the Revelation Spiritual Home, an African indigenous spiritual institution. But before I rope in Imboni to, to help me this discuss or unpack the topic and I'm saying I'm going to read you an article that was writ written for e common wealth health organization by Umeri Amunyunzu uh, Nyomongo titled the social and cultural aspects of mental health in African um, societies when the art uh, when the article defines a mental health but mental health um, is a state of well-being in which the individual realizes his or her own abilities, can cope with the normal stresses of life, can work productively and fruitfully, and is able to, to make a contribution to his or her community. Mental illness refers to all the diagnosable mental disorders which are characterized by abnormalities in thinking, feelings, or behaviors. Mental illness is closely related to vulnerability, both in its causes and its, in its effects. And then Mapindabati, the causes of e, e mental illnesses in, in Africa or mental disorder. But the social environment in many African countries does not nurture good mental health, mainly due to the myriad conflicts and post-conflict situations. War and other major disasters have a large impact on the mental health and the uh, psycho psychosocial well-being of people. Rates of mental disorder tend to double after emergencies. Widespread and frequent wars and internal strife disrupt social and community life and lead to hunger, disease, and displacement. Internal conflicts, which are either resource-based or politically instigated, are, are, are commonplace and leave long-term mental health effects on those affected. The WHO estimate that 50% of refugees have mental health problems ranging from post-traumatic stress disorder to chronic mental illness in addition, other, other natural shocks include death, chronic diseases, floods, droughts, and disease uh, epidemics have um, adverse mental health effects. Mameli Naumbugeli Emakaya, Jembe Sendi Nipazele, the causes according to uh, um, the academia, or rather according to studies that have been done in mental um, um, health. Tata, you, you are a leader of, of Abantu. Over 3 million people look up to you for spiritual um, um, guidance. And, and as you guide Abantu, you have come in contact with people who, have, who suffer from a mental um, illness. Can you Tata, please provide insight on, on, on what are the causes um, from a spiritual perspective of a mental health? And if you call an ikambi to, to cure a mental illness, Yeah, uh, it's a very broad topic. Uh, very, very, very broad because the causes of all these things, remember, really, they range from uh, you know, clinical, as you have read it yourself, uh, and then to all other social issues. So, of course, when you talk about a cure, a healing, or a solution, you must first know the problem. And because it ranges from clinical matters, it goes to noptagati and then goes to social ills. Um, as the study talks about poverty and wars in Africa and, and, and trauma. So really, um, it means that you are going to apply different methods of who assist people like that. It's not just one method, also we apply. It depends on the cause. So if you have any mental issues, you uh, are then we are going to assist the person to get rid of lemmy moya, it means aganji. 
which in this case, um, Abba's a revelation spiritual home. I've seen many. The figure behind getting well. Um, see, apply our spiritual methods to deal with moya because whenever into it's a like or there's a bad spirit, you know, more you move in to still no more you move. The moment to more you move, then things are back to normal because that was the only cause. Uh, still an abuanjalo spiritually. Kubeko nage abanyabandu who are clinically. Nala posi aba assist spiritually, but many times. If it's pure clinically, we will also advise the person, are you consult a medical? Therefore, okay, clinically, who's out all the, the, the appropriate drugs? I was good to see. Um, other people, it's depression. You know, if you have stress, then you depression. If you, uh, you don't, as you don't uh, get rid of it, then okay, mental, uh, uh, it's, a, it's a mental uh, uh, issue now. Where umuntu now it depression yeah, can say too much. You know, say too much now. It's like the brain yeah, is on overdrive and the brain yeah, is taking over. I saw I saw the kind of no booza most stress. The stress you can control loose please. Now when you want to say depressed, it's a problem. And again, uh, we first provide the counseling because what causes depression? Why are you depressed? Uh, it, it, as I'm saying, it depression for me. I overdrive your mind. You are overthinking. So why do you overthink? Katazigile, simosako, piloyako, problems ako. And normally, ge kulo counseling leyo. Besides, of course, we'll give them a spiritual intervention, but more there is counseling. We counsel, and I think banning footer revelation about Bikebe is a bit, a bit depressed, but now they are fine. Uh, because then we cancel you. We need to because kumele ulungsumkondo wako the state of your mind. You know you must be. In, it, it depression is like you are no longer in charge of your brain. You are allowing your brain yako to move away because you are just thinking and thinking. You must stop thinking too much. You need to start controlling your brain, controlling your thoughts. Um, what makes you stress? What makes you worried? You know, deal with that because if you don't deal with that, that's what's going to cause depression. So then, la posi apply in e cancelling, yeah, e cancelling. Aba sevens again yet losing. Shoot aba sevens and emit. They unama kamba ba yego power na emit straight. Which again, see how basically stigmatized in those Africa is the same as drugs you get as pale. Just la banga be seen to like isangoma or ikela. Ba go pick certain drugs that also assist you. You go to go asuk dealani issues. Um, as a herbalist as well, by the way, I have, I do herbs. This is a herb, and we have a partnership among scientists, and it's done in the lab, not in GA Sandlin. Kota Mklonyane, Sevens Mklonyane is the main ingredient. Mklonyane is an antidepressant as well. So we assist you spiritually, but also through herbal to give you this. is very good, we pose, especially before Lali. It's antidepressing, you know. You wake up feeling good, your mind refreshed. Um, you know, like an engine that um, was Because now we are living in a very, very um, challenging times. Not only South Africa, Africa, but the whole world. And Abandu are too worried now. So much is going on. So you, might, you need the antidepressing. You know, instead of taking drugs, you take antidepressing, which is natural, as a assist. So that's how we, we, we assist you. So, uh, that uh, who who are also uh, in, in in the space of spirituality, um, to uh, in a, that in an institution somewhere, as our pigs are now with with medical medicine. That you know, my depressed, um, or don't take medication. So, what, what how would you advise, or rather, how what message would we give to abantu abang apano say with I have my own institution whatever but I am eating I sell medication although I'm, I'm, I'm depressed or I'm suffering from dementia or in the, I'm, I'm bipolar good one Western I must take medicine but my leader is saying I mustn't take the medication yeah but normally it's not spiritual institutions normally yeah. it's normally religious institutions fair most of the time uh, yeah African teaching us spirituality may be like Bungumin Abanyi because the Isango might have talked, just that it's an it's a, it's a, it's, a, it's an African indigenous spiritual talk. So, 
abanye bashuka njalo we as it's you know it's a doctor that says take african medicine do not take the western medicine you see now i don't want us to debate the african and the western because it's a long time debate and at the end of the day abantu must just simply have choice what they want to do if they want to take med african medicine let them take african medicine it's um in terms of churches and religion uh they are not going to give you medicine bazothi bani faith yeah so it's our men that's what i'm saying must must be clear if it's african indigenous mostly is angoma which they, they are doctors as well so they'll be leading you to african medicine uh, churches or religious people have found this bazothi yega they are not going to give you anything but bazothi who seven see faith yakho so for me without sounding judgmental i don't agree with that because it it shows signs of ignorance you understand there's a reason why there is medicine african or western but there's a reason why kukho umuthi there is a reason why uh, um, that medication it is there because you are both spiritual and physical and so the physical part at times just like kukudla strange enough people will say ungathatha uh, medicine uphila by faith but how would by faith why faith in actualities is got the same faith here was udila with other uh, personal things it is true spiritual matters can assist in physicality but you need sometimes assistant of something else that is designed to help you ourselves you have cells inside etc so i don't agree and um, we know many people died we know many people face complications because of historic faith mm -hmm. uh, yeah so you must take your medicine uh, by the way is a spiritual guide and a healer in spiritual institution we don't tell people to stop ama treatments up we don't because um, sometimes ya obusi san shama treatment up because sometimes you need that thing to assist whatever on so if i'm bleeding so fuck it plaster I'm not say by faith stop bleeding i need to put the plaster and stop bleeding because it's reality blood is coming out it needs to be stopped and there are things called the plaster that to design to stop the blood what's the problem so mm -hmm. i can't wrong them to take medicine obviously i think africa was endowed with with african indigenous medicine which is the best and even the western worlds now mm -hmm. are starting to say hey, we want to move away from the western we want to move away from our own inventions because they have too much side effects mm -hmm. and they are called natural like my herbs they are natural all of them are natural but gay yeah, it's the choice of the people um, it's always important given the situation you must always 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 seek um to um who is spiritually inclined to guide you ka kuhle ukuthi nawe ube ube nolwazi um all right about your spiritual um your spirituality especially kakhulu kuyo imboni that always provides spiritual um wisdom and guidance uh, to his social ills as experience ngo mtu omnyama a quick reminder to please uh, subscribe and to like and leave a comment to his social i mean sorry to youtube um page here to african hidden voices thank you so much for joining in please do join us again ikulevekezayo siyabonga Oh, oh, oh.